Hi all. In this video, we will discuss how to take partial screenshot of any web page using Selenium web driver. Like, which is one of the important entry question asked by many MNC companies for the role of automation test engineer. So, and this feature is available in both the versions of Selenium, that is Selenium 3 as well as the newer version of Selenium, which is Selenium 4. Now we will see how we can do this practically. Let's take Amazon.com for the demo. This is the home page of Amazon website. So we can take the screenshot of any section of this page. For that, first we need to identify the locator of that section or the element. Then we can proceed with taking the screenshot. For that, let's right click on the page, click on inspect, which will open the Chrome DevTools with different apps like Elements Console and other things. In the Elements tab, we can see the HTML code of the Amazon website. So our goal is to identify some section and take its screenshot. Let me take, I will identify the section of gaming and ag series. Then we'll take the screenshot of this section. For that, click on the arrow mark and go to the section. See, which is highlighting the section. This is the value which is identifying, identifying the entire section but if you see it's having a id value with alphanumeric and some class value so which is difficult to identify with these two values let me go inside the that element we can see there are different elements so we can go inside the first header so here we can see the text with gaming and x series we'll identify element using this one okay let me copy that value Click on Ctrl F. Okay. Now, now we can see the value is came here. So this is the text value. So what I am doing, I am using the text path to identify this. Let's give double slash. This is inside an H2 element. So I am giving H2. Then the value is a text. So I am giving text function, which is equal to the value of the gaming and X series. So if we see this is identifying the value of gaming and axis. But if you see here it is only identifying the text but the thing we want to identify is like above div. So for that we need to traverse to the parent. Let's give slash parent to columns and the parent of the h2 tag that is div. So just give div. So, which is identifying the entire section. See if it's identifying only the gaming and accessory section. So, we want is one more parent. So, we need to go from parent to parent. That is grandparent. So, we need to repeat the same line of lines. So, let me copy and paste it here. You see, it's identifying entire section. So, this value is identifying the entire section. So, using this, we can take the screenshot of this section. In the similar way, we can take any other section's screenshot as well. Let's say beauty peaks. If I replace the value of gaming and ag series with the beauty peaks, let me do this. So it's highlighting the section of beauty peaks. Now let's move to Eclipse. Here I am having the basic code for the web driver that is setting the path to the driver and invoking the object of web driver here we can pass the url that we want to open and for this uh, screenshot we need two dependencies one is selenium to do the browser actions and another is commerce.io to store the screenshot as a physical file now let's copy the value of url from the browser which is amazon.com copy it and paste it inside the two curly braces so now what we want to do here, we want to take the screenshot of this section, beauty peaks. For that, just copy the X part we have just identified and paste it inside this here. Now we have to create one variable to store the this section. So for that, we will use web driver, like web element interface. So web element element is the name we are giving equal to driver dot find element by dot export so this is the export right so using this we are identifying that element so just cut the value from here and replace inside the double quotes so this is the value of 
the entire section that means we are storing the section in one variable so what we have to do next is like we want to take the screenshot of that section for that just take element dot screenshot is what we want just write screenshot there is an available method for taking the screenshot that is get screenshot as so double click on that so this is the method useful for taking the screenshot so we have after taking the screenshot we have to convert that output into a sum file so for that we need to give the parameter output type just type OET out click on control space which will give us some options so we have to select this output type click on enter or double click and remove that extra words and click on dot so this will give us the available output types the output type we want is a file so and its written type is like java ivo dot file so just click on that so it is returning a java file object so we have to store inside the file of java let's use some name so the the thing we want to store is java dot ivo so we have to save it inside the java dot ivo file so what we did in this step is right we have taken the screenshot and the converted that output into a file object so in the next step what we have to do is right convert this file object into a real file or a physical file using the file utils class which is available in commons dot ivo now just take file utils file utils is a package available inside the commons dot ivo so inside that we need to use copy file is the method just use copy file pass the file object we have as a first parameter and as a second parameter we want to create a new file so give new file and give the value of file we want we want to create let's say i want to create ss.png so i am giving ss.png as a name of the file either if you want to give some path we can provide that path so that it will create the screenshot in that path if we only pass the name of the file it will create the file inside this main directory so it will create here so it is throwing an error because we have to throw some exceptions that is add throws declaration it is adding iv exception so now save the file right click run as java application it is opening the chrome driver so it is open amazon.com website it scrolled and taken the screenshot for this port beauty pix let me close this and see if that screenshot is captured or not see there is no error because it our code is success so let's refresh this here we can see ss.png let me double click on it see here it has taken nice screenshot for only that single section whatever we identified 